kids, it's Coco. Welcome back to my Ate's channel. For today's video, you will be seeing me. Joke lang. <laughs> Close it, baby. Bye! Japanese snacks and originally I was supposed to film this with my bestie but sobrang tagal na namin pinaplano pero hindi siya natutuloy to go here so I just decided to film this myself I hope you guys still enjoy it anyway so I bought these snacks for my recent Japan trip with my boyfriend and his family and then some of the snacks here are from my parents last trip in Japan which was like a month ago so sinama ko na rin siya so that I can share with you guys my thoughts on um, Japanese snacks I think I don't need to explain further let us just get started if you want to see me trying out Japanese snacks then please do continue watching okay so if you are wondering where I bought these snacks I bought these from Don Ki Don Quixote so Don Quixote is everywhere in Japan there's a Tokyo Osaka Nagoya everywhere it's in everywhere so yeah I bought most of these snacks from Don Quixote and then the other snacks I don't know where my parents bought it. Where do we start first? As you can see, most of these are sweet. But it's not hindi sweet because this is salty. So I think we should go first to the sweets so that we don't have to change palate. Natin. There's such a feeling foody. So first is this one. This is Ghana. I'm not even sure if this is a Japanese snack because it's yung brand niya, which is in curry. But this is super good. I like it. It's really milk chocolate. But then when Vince and his brother, si Shoti, tried this, sabi nila lasang dark chocolate daw. Pero, ewan ko, for me lasang milk chocolate siya. But then, this is from Lotus. So I'm not sure if this is valid. It looks like this. So individually wrapped siya. The chocolate looks like this. If you're Filipino, it looks similar sa chocolate, pero the texture is very malapit siya. Hindi siya parang chocolate na powder. It kind of tastes like Choco Baby. If you're familiar, yung Meiji. Yeah, I should have bought Choco Baby. But yeah, it tastes like Choco Baby, but sweeter. The next snack that I will be trying... Oh, it's Meiji milk chocolate. I'm now sure that this is from Japan. And for their packaging, in fairness, ang cute niya. Kasi meron siyang parang open here. Nakikilahin mo lang. And then, the chocolate comes out. So yun, um, just like the Lotte one, it is also individually packed. They almost look the same. As in, same box. Same yung opening niya. Pero yun, well, different brands sila. Kasi nga, as far as I know, Lotte is from Korea. And Meiji is a Japanese brand. So, the chocolate looks like this, pag naka wrap pa. And then when you open it, it looks like this lang. Meiji is certain on the chocolate bar, on the small chocolate bar. Hmm. This definitely tastes like Choco Baby. So, there is a difference. This is sweeter than this one. Mm -hmm. But both are good. We are done with that. Let us go to these two. Okay. So, the difference of these two is ito. I bought this Meiji Almond from Don Quixote for my recent trip. And then this one naman, my parents bought this from their recent trip in Tokyo. So, I don't get it. Nakalagay dito, cool. So, I'm not sure bakit may cool na nakalagay. Pero it looks exactly the same. It says, Baby KIY X. I think it's a collaboration, but I don't really get it. Yeah, I don't get it. <laughs> Pag-iba din yung nakalagay sa likod. Sir, let's try it. So, I'm opening first the one that I bought. So, the packaging looks like this when you open it. Um, ayan, may mga almond chocolate inside. Let's try it. So, it looks like this. It's an almond chocolate. Almond. Okay, let's try it. So, same now. It's from Meiji kasi, so the chocolate is the same as the one that I tasted here. And yung almond niya, roasted flavor talaga siya. As in, nalalasang yung chocolate. I mean, yung pagka-roasted niya. Okay. I'm not sure kasi pili ko pareho lang sila. Same na, same mo. Pero sige, titikman na din natin. Yeah. 
This is definitely the same. So far, ito yung mas gusto ko kaysa dito kasi may amat siya. Okay, the next that I'll be trying is this one. Sorry, my bad. So, if you're familiar with this girl, I saw her sa Uniqlo. I really don't know what this snack is. Pero kasi, ang cute niya. So, binili ko siya. Binagpot ko siya dun sa Don Quixote. Um, the packaging looks like this. Ang cute yung box niya. Parang may flowers sa taas. Okay, it's open now. Let us see what's inside of this Fujia Milky. Oh! Oh my goodness, what is this? I'm not sure if it's something that you mix in liquid or what. Because I don't know, I think it's syrup. Is it maple syrup? But yeah, let us try it. Glory. Oh, it's individually packed. Amazing. It smells like syrup. Can these look like this? It is individually packed. Let us try it. Oh, parang may ganito tayo sa Philippines, de ba? Like the sticky milky ball. It smells like caramel, na honey na syrup. Oh my god! It literally tastes like honey. As in, lasa siyang honey. Although, which is weird. Oh my god! No stuck sa teeth ko. Kind of weird for me because it's not like that. It's good, huh? I think Pa would like this. It's kind of good. It's kind of good. As in, it's just like syrup and honey. I can't read it because I'm really sorry, but at least you get to see my reactions. My awkward reactions. I think I need some salt, huh? So, let us try this cheese. Cheese from Galico. What's Galico ba? Because if you've been to Japan or if nakita nakita niyo naman sa Japan, dun sa Osaka famous yung Galico sign. Yung guy na nakaganon. <laughs> Awkward. And then it says, oh you can actually eat this. Pwede mo siya ilagay sa oven. Amazing. Pero since tamad ang ate niyo, hindi na ako tatayo at titikman ko na lang to. And then meron pang nakalagay dito is bagay to sa wine. <laughs> Which is parang okay, cause it's cracker sha, and then it's cheese ba, and then who doesn't love cheese? Mas gusto naman ako sa intolerance, but oh my god. Okay, so let us open it now. Oh, amazing! The packaging nyan is the one with the seal. Yung parang zip lock, so you can close it after. Di masisira yung crunchiness ng crackers nyo. So it looks like this, and let us try it. Mmm, mm. it's good. Mmm, amazing. Masarap sa alag. Like Ang alat niya masarap. Too salty. I like it. Good. Bagay nga siya sa wine. Recommend. What else? I think this is matcha. Yeah, it says matcha. It's like stego. If you're familiar with stego, it's the wafer. The tube that has chocolate inside, but this one has matcha. And then the other green thing is Kit Kat wasabi. I know wasabi. Like, why? But I've tried this already, and it kind of tastes like white chocolate, and it smells like wasabi. But anyway, let us get to the matcha first. It says chocolate lubera matcha, and the brand is Bourbon. Some Japanese writing, and then it says Bourbon. And it says six, so I think there are six pieces inside. Let us open it. Oh, it's individually packed then. Well, I'm not wasting it. So, it is a matcha wafer. And I, I like matcha drinks. Like the matcha tea, matcha Starbucks drink. I don't like it. I like it hot lang talaga hot tea. Pero, yun. Hindi din ako mahilig sa matcha na cakes. But I will be brave and I will try this for you guys. It smells like the matcha powder. It smells like that as in. Okay, so let's try it. Oh my god, I don't wanna like, make a mess. Yeah, it tastes like matcha. 
Pero ako, masanay talaga ako sa matcha na ininom. Oh my god. I need water, sorry. No offense sa mga matcha lovers dyan, pero gusto ko talaga yung matcha ko with water. Like hot water. Next is, I will try something that I think I will like. And it's this one. It's from the same brand as the matcha one. Um, some Japanese writing and then it says verb one. As you can see from the packaging, yung isang chocolate is dark and then yung isang is light. So I think it's milk and dark. And let us try it. I love chocolate with crackers. I'm kind of excited to try this. Actually, I'm going to try it. 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 Okay, so it has two kinds. A light blue one and a dark blue one. So I'm guessing this is the dark chocolate and then this is the milk chocolate. So let us try it. I'm super excited. For the milk chocolate, muna, the light one. Oh, it looks like yung Lu. If you're familiar with Lu, yung Japanese brand, ata yun na Lu. Parang may ship dun sa chocolate bar niya sa taas ng cracker. It's not sweet, but it's very chocolate. Good. I'll try the other one. Yeah, it's definitely dark chocolate. Yeah, dark yung color niya. I like this dark chocolate better. Pero ita kabi mo na siya kasi. Ang may na. Pero masarap to. I like the dark one better than the milk chocolate one. The next one is this one. So it is the Sakura Japanese Sake Kit Kat. Um, if you're familiar with sake, it's their alcohol. It's their wine. Japanese wine. Let's try it! I've been seeing this Japanese Sake Kit Kat on Instagram. The ads. Like purple, I love the colors and yon. So let's try it. It's pink and it smells like wine. Oh my goodness! As in, I'm a shot, 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 shot. Weirdly, that has some white chocolate na. May pagka strawberry. Na hindi ko maintindihan. Well, if you know me, alam mo hindi ako maintindi sa strawberry. Mm, mm, mm. It tastes like the Sakura ice cream I've tried sa Japan, obviously. Version strawberry, cherry ish, na white chocolate. Yun. And it really smells like alcohol. Pero, it's a no for me. I don't like. Oh my god, lasa siyang alcohol pag tagal talaga. I'm not OA. Jump. Joke. But yeah, it does taste like alcohol. Okay, and the next one that I'll be trying is the Wasabi Kit Kat. So it looks like this. The packaging looks like this. It's just a box. And then, now I'm gonna get one. And I didn't really like it, but I'll try this for you guys so that you can see what my reaction is when I try it. And yeah, I'll also share my thoughts. On this Kit Kat, and I'll probably give this to Ate M after. It smells like wasabi, no joke. Just like this one, it smells like Japanese sake. This one, it tastes like wasabi. It tastes like wasabi. And I don't like wasabi. Oh my god, my voice is changing. Oh my god, my voice is changing. But yeah, it tastes like wasabi. Oh my god, my voice is changing. As in, unang bite pa lang. Lasang lasang man yung wasabi. Yung smell nga ng wasabi kit kat, hindi ganun katapang like the Japanese sake. Pero as in, lasang lasang yung wasabi. I'm so excited. I think I can eat this now. But yeah, this is mochi. Mochi is a famous dessert in Japan. And so this mochi has chocolate and strawberry inside. And it's pretty good. Um, if you don't know what mochi is, um, if you're Pinoy, para siyang tikoy na may parang um, confectioner sugar sa labas na hindi naman ganun katamis. 
and may feeling siya sa loob. So, yun. And yeah, I think we are done. I think I all ready tried everything except this one because I'm really full and hindi ko na kaya. <laughs> Naumay ako dito sa KitKat na to, yung dalawa. But yeah, overall, my favorite is this one, the Luigi Almonds, and this one, what the dark chocolate for. Thank you for watching, guys. If you haven't watched my Japan vlog yet, the recent one, the one with my boyfriend and his family, then please go check that out. I'll put the link on the description box of this video. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this. Um, Let me know what are your favorite Japanese snacks, or if you tried the ones that I've tried just now, then please let me know your thoughts or anything else and yeah chat with me on the comments box thank you guys for watching <laughs> no, I don't know thank you guys for watching um please do remember to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't and click on the bell icon to get notified whenever i post something thanks for watching guys see you in my next one bye